KFNN. Headline News Update. And welcome to the 2 p.m. update with me, David White. What do we have? We're up about four tenths of a percent on the S and P cash. Nasdaq's way up. Again, um, a handful of really large or big cap companies. The top ones have a lot of people that are short, and they're on the wrong side of the uh, trade. Uh, we continue to see that in stocks like Tesla today. Uh, I did not look in the last few minutes. Let's see what we have here. Da, da, da. We'll get that. Uh, Tesla's up another 10% today. But uh, if you've listened to my show, we talk about the last thing you want to do is be short a stock that people are shorting 40 or 45% of every single day. Yeah, if everybody has the same idea on a short, you're probably going to be taken to the woodshed uh, if you're short your, themselves. Two, uh, if you gap up, and you have a lot of shorts in it, just figure that they're not going to let those folks out fairly easily. Uh, they're going to, some of those people who are going to bend uh, out there on margin, and they're going to take them to the woodshed. Uh, if you've never been to the woodshed, you don't want to go. Uh, that's why you should have stops and take your stops. Uh, of course, the old saying is, if you don't take a little stop, one day you're going to take the mother of all stocks. So, um, see what we have here going on. Eh, it broke. We'll fix it here. So, we have uh, kind of a quiet day, about 7 billion shares on the CBOE as we come back up. Uh, I thought uh, as poor as the volume was that we'd probably find that Somewhere around 4,000 was the top of this uh, counter trend move in a bear market. Uh, we're now just 23 points away from hitting 4,100. Uh, the question is, is that when the shorts are going to give up shorting and we're going to reverse? Now, come Monday, China's back open. Wednesday, we've got the Fed. Thursday, fund buying probably starts coming back in. So it's going to be a big week. Get your rest this weekend. The reality is that navigating financial markets